Hi everybody, Lorraine here. I'm very excited. Today I am doing a collaboration with Susan King. Her art channel is Art by Susan King on YouTube. And we got together and did some talking and decided that we are going to do a reverse dip bottle bottom pour. And the colors that we decided to use was three different colors of blue, a little bit of green, and a little bit of yellow so that we make a flower. And what I have here is an 8x8 canvas. Just putting a white base down. And I just have the bottle of, bottom of a bottle here. I'm going to set it in the center of my canvas. And I'm going to start with an ultramarine blue. Just pour it down. Let it go down the little sections. Don't want too much paint on. Just let that run down. Susan is a fantastic artist. I love watching her videos. Everything that she does, the colors are just absolutely amazing. So I'm very excited to be working with her today. I'm also going to be using a turquoise blue. Put some of that down the center. Guide it down the... I'm going to be doing two rounds here, so I don't want to put too much. And I also have a cobalt blue that I'm going to use on top of that. My paints are just mixed with Floetrol and water. I've left them a little bit thick for this. I just want enough paint on here until the little petals meet together. So pretty, pretty little lines in there. Not quite meeting together. I'm going to put just a little bit more of the ultramarine on here because that one's my favorite. <laughs> Give it a minute to run down. Very carefully pick this up. Okay, I'm going to put just a little bit of yellow. I don't want to 
want it to take over. In here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in to the center. Kind of guide it in. I'm wiping my stick every time I do this because I don't want to muddy up my colors. And now I'm going to bring my colors outward. pretty. Want to make some leaves. So I'm going to put a little bit of green on the outside edges just to get the idea. Of a leaf. Here. And that's uh, an emerald green, and I'm going to go back in with some turquoise green just to add some depth. Okay. What I have is a piece of plastic. I've done this with saran wrap in the past, and the saran wrap wants to stick to itself. So I've been saving the plastic off of my canvas packages, and that's what this is. I'm going to try to set it down in the middle like this and let it fall out. I need to get it work out any little air bubbles that are in there. More over here. Okay, I think I have them all. The moment of truth. I'm just going to lift this slowly. it together at the center. Get the other corners. Bring those up. Bring this up. Gather it all together. And just slowly pick it up. Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, so happy with that. Oh, it's so pretty. Give it a torch, get rid of some of the air bubbles in it. This is one of my favorite, favorite ways to make a flower, to dip it like this. And the bottle bottom gives it such a nice shape. It's very pretty, very pretty. Let me bring it up so you can get a close-up. The little 
cells that are happening around the outside edge of the petals. So pretty. Well, there we go, guys. There's my piece. I can't wait to see Susan's. And we'll post our videos together. Make sure you go to her channel and check hers out. And thanks for coming and visiting with me, guys. I appreciate it. <laughs> Remember to subscribe to my channel. Hit the little bell so you get a notification when I upload a video. And thanks for visiting. Bye.